Hello, young man. I can only see a bottom and poo at the moment. I can, <laughs> I can see, oh, there's a face, look. Yeah, there's, a there's a face. First ones of the year. Come on in, my little babies. All open for the babies. Excellent. Oh, they're quite cute, look at that. Yeah. How are you doing, eh? How are you doing? We got no mummy, have we? We got no mummy, but we're very cute. Are you going to go into your bed? Does that look nice? You forget how small they are every year. You Come on then. Oh, you're going in with your brother or sister. In you go then. Go on. Go on, in you go. The whole world's turned upside down, isn't it? Yeah. But they'll get a good start. You're a bit bigger. Fine, so what was the story of these again? Uh, Derek was called out because a guy uh, went outside his house. Yeah. You know, the, the three cubs were sat outside his house and when he walked to his car they followed him. So the story was he, he managed to uh, contain them. Right. Uh, Derek came over, had a look round, found a set which looked like it had been ploughed over. Right. A uh, huge clump of earth had fallen, he's in a huge clump, had fallen into the set. Oh, that's sad, isn't things it? would have probably killed the mother. Yeah. Uh, so then he made the decision to bring the cubs, take the cubs back to his. And then they come down to wildlife age. Yeah. Right, off we go again, badger number four. A lady rang me on the Saturday. Right. She said that that was on the footpath. That's only 20, 30 metres away from the, the set. Right. Um, she'd spoken, she waited and kept a distance but didn't see any mum or anything, so she was concerned. Gave it water and some cat food. She went back the next morning, first thing, that was in a bad way, not moving. She Crossy. She was dead, so I said, well, I'll, I'll come out and get it. She said, well, I think you'd be wasting your time, but. Right. Picked it up and I must admit I did think it was dead, but then yeah. I like, scruffed it. And that then weed and it just took right, okay. breath. So, but, but yeah, he's a feisty little boy. Isn't he? You're feisty. I've been pooing. Yeah. Come on, uh, you can't hide. You can't hide because you've got to come with me. Yeah. Come on, little squeak. You can join three friends. How's that, eh? I might just mark this one so we know the difference between the one and the three. That's fine. Go and join your friends, go on. Look, lots of little badgers. Yes, they're all cuddling together, it's nice. Yeah, who are you? Yeah. Well, that's the fourth badger of the day and the fourth badger of the year. Um, how many we actually end up with, I've no idea. We normally get up to about 20, but they're all the same size, which is a really good start. And they'll be with us now all the way until they're released sometime in the autumn, September, October. So great stuff. Later that evening, it was feeding time for our latest stripey arrivals. Although most were old enough to eat for themselves, the smallest of the group still required a bit of encouragement. The cub was fed a mixture of special food and a highly palatable oral rehydration solution used to gradually encourage them onto solid food. To see how these badger cubs are doing, visit our website and tune in to one of our live webcams. If you like our videos, please subscribe to our channel by pressing the red button. And make sure you hit the bell to get notifications of our latest content. If you want to help us save wildlife, please donate. Every pound you give will help us to save more wildlife.